This presentation is designed to introduce you to Metastock and accompanying software and data. It is not intended as a recommendation to buy or sell. The information, software, and techniques presented should only be used by investors who are aware of the risks inherent in trading. Equus International and Thomson Reuters shall have no liability for any investment decisions based on the use of their software. Any trading strategies or any information provided in connection with these companies. Thank you for your interest in Metastock software. In just a moment, you will see a demonstration of the Metastock Power Tools. Our presenter will use real market data to show how Metastock can help you do everything from finding the right trade, to knowing when to take the trade, to testing your trading strategy. Metastock has been helping investors make better trades for over 25 years. Hundreds of thousands of copies have been sold in over 97 countries. Moreover, Metastock has won the Stocks and Commodities Reader's Choice Award for the last 16 years. And Metastock is a product of Thomson Reuters, the world's leading source of intelligent information for businesses and professionals for over 100 years. If you are currently trading or just thinking about it, you likely have a goal to become successful. And yet the vast majority of traders are not successful. The reasons for failure in the market are as varied as the traders themselves. Generally speaking, successful traders follow several basic principles. 1. Trading is about beating the odds. You won't always make winning trades. To be profitable in the long run, you simply need to minimize your losses and maximize your wins. 2. Don't trade with your heart. Experienced traders know that emotions like fear and greed should have no part in trading decisions. 3. Have a plan with realistic expectations. Finding a method that works for you and sticking to it is a critical element to long-term success. Successful traders rarely become successful overnight. Finally, many successful traders employ the science of technical analysis to help them forecast the direction of the market. Stated simply, technical analysis is the study of security prices over time to help predict future performance. The primary tool is a chart showing price and volume. Just as a weatherman uses past and current weather trends to forecast the weather, traders have been using technical analysis for decades to forecast the market. Imagine if you could use technical analysis to scan thousands of securities to provide a list of stocks that match your trading criteria. What if you could choose from over 100 strategies developed by industry experts to help you decide when to buy and when to sell? What if you could test your strategies on a multitude of securities to see which one would have performed best over time, before you spend your first trading dollar? Finally, imagine having access to real-time market data, just like the professionals, including lightning fast market news. Well, this is what Metastock Power Tools is all about. They include the Explorer, a powerful search tool used to scan the market for the best trades based on your customized criteria. The Expert Advisor, this amazing tool puts a virtual expert by your side to show you not only when to buy and sell, but also to provide a commentary explaining each system and indicator. And finally, the System Tester, this essential tool allows you to backtest your strategies to see how they would have performed over time, a critical step for any technical analyst. Now, let's take a closer look at each power tool and how they can help you become a successful trader. As you've just learned, the Metastock Power Tools will help you in identifying trading opportunities and help you know more of when to get in and when to get out. As we move into the Metastock Power Tools, I'd first like you to take a moment and look at the chart on your screen. Here we see a typical chart with price and volume. If you were just getting started with trading and you were to open up this chart, would you know whether you should make a trade? When trading, you may not know the best time to make your move into a trade, and certainly you don't want to rush into a trade, and that's where the Metastock Power Tools will help. One of the most difficult things for a trader is finding a trading opportunity, and that's where our first tool, the Explorer, starts working for us. The Explorer lets us scan the market or a select group of stocks to identify possible opportunities. So let's actually start there. I'm going to come up to my first power tool, the Explorer, click on the binoculars, and the first thing you'll notice is actually quite a list of possible scans that we can run to identify trading opportunities. 
If you don't find what you're looking for built into the Explorer, you can actually design your own scans as well. For example, today we're actually going to come down here to the MACD by signal. If you're not familiar with the MACD, that's okay. We'll find out more about it in just a few moments. Let's actually go ahead and click on Explore here. Now again, if you're interested in scanning the entire market, you can do that. If you want to select a, just a select group of stocks, you can do that as well. For our example today, we're actually going to just scan the S&P 500. So I'm going to open up that folder, select all those stocks, and hit Open. Hit OK. And now the Explorer is going to take the MACD, look for a buy signal with that particular indicator, and eliminate out all the other stocks that I don't want to look at. So it's really saving me some time here. Okay, we now have a list of stocks. Let's go ahead and hit reports. And you'll see it's kicked back just a, quite a number of stocks for us here. Let's actually just pick a few. I'll click open chart so we can take a look at these. Okay, let's go ahead and hit close, close. And first off, what we're looking at here is General Mills. I can actually just click this button and be able to see all the charts that I opened up. But let's just go back into General Mills. Now that I have General Mills open, I know that I have a buy opportunity on this particular stock because the Explorer told me I did. But what do I do now? Well, first off, I scanned for a MACD buy opportunity. So I could actually come up here into the Metastock Indicator Quick List, grab the MACD, and apply it to my chart. Hit OK here. OK, so now I have the MACD indicator on my chart. Well, I may not know what the MACD is, and I want to learn more about it. So what I can do, and this is one of the best features in Metastock, besides the Power Tools, is actually the Help function. So if I click on Help, it will actually give me a definition of what the MACD is, give me an overview, and walk me through it. Well, that may be great for some people. I may be able to read it and kind of get a definition uh, out of a dictionary of it. But what I may want to do is I'm more of a visual tr learner, okay? So I may want to see how it actually works on my chart. I'll come up here to our expert advisor. Now the expert advisor is the tool that gives us buy and sell signals on the chart. It gives us commentary telling us how to be interpreting what we're seeing on the chart and then taking it to the next level. As you can see here, there's actually quite a number of experts built into the program. Let's actually go ahead and match up the MACD, which is our scan that we did. I'll go ahead and hit attach and close. And you'll now see that I have a buy signal highlighted on my chart. And we get an alert saying the MACD has just crossed above its signal line. This is a bullish signal. Okay, well let's go ahead and look at this just a little bit more. I'm going to zoom in just a little bit. I'm going to grab one of my drawing tools over here. And we'll see here with my buy signal, and I come down here to my indicator, I had a crossing of the signal line, just like my alert said, and that triggered a buy signal for me. Now if I go back in time, you can see I have crossings, and every time I do, a buy or sell is triggered. Okay. Now what I can do is my next step, I'm going to right click on my chart here, go to Expert again, and go to Commentary. And the commentary is really where the expert gives you depth of what you're seeing on your chart. It really walks you through what you're seeing and how you should be using that information. Okay. So it gives me more definition on the MACD, tells me exactly what's happening with General Mills and then walks me through more information. So the expert can really give me a full view of what's happening on any particular security. For just a moment, I'd like to show you another expert. I'm going to detach this expert. And I'm going to switch our charting style here to candlesticks for just a moment. 
and I'll go back into the expert advisor again. Now a lot of people use candlestick charting because it tells a story. And one of the hardest things to do is understand that story. So we have experts built in around candlesticks as well. So if I hit this, it will actually